Hey, this is Soldier7 here reporting for Right Wing Federation, and this video is going to be about the uh, Democratic National Convention of 2024, also known as the DNC, which occurred recently in Chicago, and I guess I'm going to talk about it a little and give my opinion about it, um, just like I did with the RNC that occurred last month in Milwaukee. I guess I'm going to do the same thing here, but with the uh, DNC. So, uh, yeah, here it goes. As you know, uh, last week the Democrats held their national convention in Chicago. And like I said, I didn't see all of it, but I did see some of it. You know, I didn't see all of it. Just like with the RNC, I didn't see all of it. But I did, but I didn't see, but I did see some of it, you know, with the DNC. And um, all I can just say is, is I'm not feeling it. Like, that's really the only thing I can come up with is I'm not feeling it. Granted, even though I didn't see all of it, I did see some of it. I saw some of the speeches and so forth and even went back to look at a few images and so forth and I mean I don't know me personally I think it just came off as mostly negative like the RNC which I felt like it came off as mostly positive I feel like in this case with the DNC it came off as mostly negative and I'm not saying that out of bias I'm just saying that out, out of honest you know just to be honest um, some of the things that I did see just came off as kind of negative and at times even kind of awkward. So there was that. And, um, even though I know you had some people praising the DNC, saying how, talking about how positive it was and how, uh, there were some certain mu performances by musicians and so forth and certain people having speeches there and so forth and I'm like well that's great and all but for me personally it came off as mostly negative um, just to look just to cap some of the things that I saw um, the Obamas you know gave a speech and um, even though it uh, when it comes to Barack Obama, I'll say, even though I think he's a good talker, but the speech he gave at the DNC just came off as negative. It just kind of made me feel negative and everything. It was just like, yeah. And then you had Bernie Sanders, who at one point was giving a speech, and he was talking about billionaires and talking about, yeah, he was criticizing them and so forth. And then right after he was finished... He introduces a billionaire who is the current governor of Illinois, who happens to be a billionaire. So there was that. And then, of course, you know, the DNC started with Joe Biden giving his farewell speech, I guess. I don't know. That's what some people may be calling it. And then it ended with Kamala uh, accepting the party's ticket to be the nominee to run for president of 2024 and so forth, which we all know. And another thing I also understand is that there was some things occurring outside the DNC. There were some protests or even some riots. And that kind of got me thinking, um, thinking of something similar, not exactly the same, but similar to 1968 where the DNC was held in Chicago and there were protests and or riots and so forth held outside. And a part of me wondered, even though it was different cases, the cases were different, but a part of me wonders if we're seeing something similar. Um, a part of me even wonders if, yeah, if this is 1968 all over again. Is it? Is this 1968 all over again? I don't know. I don't really have much to say. So, yeah, I'm just going to leave it there. But, yeah, you you have any takes, feel free. The comments are open. That's all I'm going to say for right now. This is Soldier 7. Thanks for listening.